Hi, Sarah here with you, and uh, I'm back again on this channel, and I'm gonna be doing episode reviews on some of my favorite animes for this season, and I think I'm gonna be reviewing all of the romantic stuff, and uh, today's review is going to be Say I Love You, or Skinny Iteo. I hope I've mentioned that right, because I think I butchered the name. So, I will be starting uh, doing reviews from episode 6. Um, but quickly, my impression on the first 5 episodes. So far, the 5 uh, first episodes were kind of had a good pace. We have been introduced to new characters in every episode, and we have seen May develop or a uh, character becoming more open to people and uh, she's starting to trust others and make more friends. Episode 6 to be honest was a bit boring. I mean the first five episodes were there was always something happening. There was something that will surprise you like the first episode for example that was an incredible episode. It has probably the best impact on me till today. It's still my favorite episode. Another episode and was the episode in which Kurosawa was talking about his memories and we had the surprise help from uh, one of the girls that liked Kurosawa but I think that was a bit extreme actually in which he goes to sleep with her just to make her feel she's pretty. Um, but anyways, there was always something that's going on in this episode, there wasn't really that much. I mean, we know that Kurosawa has been always popular with girls and gr girls are trying to hit on him all the time. And uh, the model, I think, uh, I thought that she would turn out to be more nastier than this, but she's really friendly. And I think that's probably why this episode was so boring, was because of the friendly nature of the model. I wanted to see a bit of a nasty side to her, like trying to steal Kurosawa from Mei. I know that Mei is, uh, till this point, feels like she's uncertain and uh, she feels like he's been drifting away. And yes, this kind of felt a little boring also, but because of Mei's personality and nature, I kind of accepted the that of the story, but I kind of wanted to see May put a little bit more struggle with her relationship with Kurosawa, because at this point the the relationship kind of seems uh, boring. Nothing new is happening like the first five episodes. And with that, guys, I bring my review to an end. And uh, just a little reminder, I am doing a web comic. You might like to check it. It's called Mystic Star and uh, you'll be able to read it for free. I will leave the links in which you can read it uh, from. And that is it. And that's the end of that review. I will see you later. Bye-bye.